Hello, and welcome to Roseplay Classic Season 6, Episode 21. As always, I'm your host, Oin Moon Rose, and today we'll hopefully beat that thing. And continue the let's play of Earthbound. So last time we lost miserably because we kept running into fools. Well, I did have to waste a bit of my PP again, but not as badly. Unfortunately, on the way here, Adama got homesick again. So we had to deal with Adama being a homesick little boy. Burp. So you are Adama. Yep, nope, still repeating that one. Yeah. I'm hoping we can win this time. We're not going to waste all our PP. But we are going to spend some of it. And hope for the best. 72 is a nice start. Yeah, I'm honestly fine with that. We'll do this one more time, and then we won't do any more for her him. Because we're going to need to heal. Goodness knows I want to beat Belch. His body solidified, that's a positive. Whew. Was able to move. Oh, so yeah. No, we're fine. We'll let this go. We'll heal when he gets under a certain point. Yay, it's solidified. We're doing good. He might not even be able to summon anybody, which is kind of what screwed us the last time. Of course it didn't work on Akira. Alright, we're gonna heal, hopefully. You know, I honestly, I honestly don't know how this one's gonna work. Maybe it'll solidify him? Now. A continuous attack. Beautiful. Nope! Crap. Alright. The continuous attack was a little bit much to uh, deal with. I love that we're missing. Edge closer. Cause that's beautiful. Lost all motivation. Beautiful. Alright, we're gonna heal before anything bad happens. Then we're gonna heal our next turn. Yeah, you keep edging closer and, and see what that gets ya. Whoops, no. I am not doing good at figuring this out, am I? Well, this is the last one we can do, so, uh... Yeah, let's hope this kills him. Nope, started a continuous attack. Well, 38 ain't a grand whole lot, but... Thank goodness nobody can. I'm serious. 
started a continuous attack. Come on! Healer! Healer! Oh, thank goodness. But we're kind of out of HP. So... Unless we win... That's actually going to be a fail. You know... I never even thought about the fly, honey. Master Belts, grab the fly, honey. I yeah, know we're gonna lose, though. Lost his mind by wolfing down the fly, honey. Wow, we lost! Cool! I can't believe he ruined us a second time. Three levels! Who would have thought? Ah. Lost his mind. Yeah, but see, it's it's not working. That's beautiful. You know, I didn't think about the wolf honey twice. I wish I would have thought of that. Cause now I have to gain three more levels. Yeah, no, that's fine. Kill me. Yeah, I did! I don't even know how! Oh, yeah, I know, because one thing! I'm homesick! Idiots! Alright. Nope, that was wrong. Oh, it was right? Crap. Crap! Yeah, you can tell I'm, I'm massively annoyed. <sighs> Alright. We will go ahead and jump ahead to me gaining three.
three more levels, which will put us at level 37. But until then, I'll see you in about two seconds, jump-wise. Maybe we'll win the next time. If not, I'm feeling really pathetic right now. Really pathetic. Alright, flash forward. Alright, so we are back after I've gained three more stupid levels. That probably did not need to happen. And I got a mouth that doesn't want to stand still. Alright, so as promised, we are at... Apparently the wrong status screen. We're on 37. Adam is again somehow homesick. Uh, apparently if he starts crying, he's got to think about his mama. Ugh. And we're gonna try the, uh, whatever it was, bee honey, or, I don't remember, whatever it is that he likes, jelly, honey, we're gonna try that again. And hopefully he is too busy wolfing down on it, as he puts it, to do anything, and I can just murder him. Alright, so, Master Belch attacked. Yeah, not if I have anything to say about it. Now, First thing, do not get homesick, because I will be very, very angry. Alright, plus I learned Psy Freeze. I don't know what symbol that is, but apparently it does 408s and freezes him, so I'm cool with that. Adam open the jar of fly honey, Master Belt grab the fly honey. Alright, let's go ahead and waste a little bit of Psy Games. Yeah, you got nothing better to do. You continue to waste your, uh, magic salt. I mean, heck, you are literally the strongest fighter in our team. With me being... Really? Lost his mind by... He did nothing! Nothing! We'll try this one more time. I could have swore side games was working. The last time. Solidify. You know, I feel like that went on a lot longer than last time, even without the honey. All right, Oculus 33, offense one, max HP one. Let's move on. Looks like it was an even fight. Well, he burped himself. I'm not going to copy that. But Master Gygus has managed to get the Manny Manny statue into four side. That still sounds like a dirty thing. The city will soon be in worse condition than living in your own puke. You would know, dude. Suffer, Spanky! And he burps again. Alright, let's see what's in the next room. A cave. Hi! I escaped! Zoom! Boing! Goody! I don't know what those are, but they, they scare me. Alright, you work... Oh no, you worn down? Ah, boing! Stinky pee! Ooh! I'm getting out of here. Oh! Wait, what? So, I couldn't get up here without beating him, and you guys put a ladder up after I beat the boss? Screw you, you guys could have saved me some trouble. I want my money back. Go in hot spring, wash barf off your body. Or you body. Sure, probably. Hot springs, rest here. Oh! I, uh... You got in and washed all the extremely dirty gunk off your body. Okay, I was kind of afraid of what was going on. Longer ladder can go to hot springs. Yeah, stuff you should have had before. Drink coffee before go. Say yes to me, say no to me. 
I'm not gonna be drugged and, uh, bad things done to me, am I, if I say yes? Sure. Bottoms up, boing! What did I just say? You traveled very far from home. I saw uh, you drugged me. You roofied me. Do you remember how your long and winding journey began with someone pounding at your door? Yeah, and it ended with me getting uh, roofied. It was pokey. Oh, don't even go there. The worst person in your neighborhood who knocked on the door that fateful night. On your way, you have walked through, or you have walked, thought, and fought. Yet through all this, you have never lost your courage. You have grown steadily stronger, though you have experienced the pain of battle many times. Yeah, six levels worth. I still want my money back on that one. Like, really, why? You are no longer alone in your adventures. Saul, who is steadfast, kind, and even pretty. STOP TRYING TO FORCE PEOPLE ON ME! ...is always at your side. Akita is with you as well. Though he is timid, he came from a distant land to help you. Adama, as you certainly know by now, you are not a regular young man. Okay, uh, you roofied me and are you talking to me or am I hearing voices in my head? You have an awesome destiny to fulfill. I'm going to start by getting a lobotomy. The journey from this point will be long and it'll be more difficult than anything you have undergone to this point. God, I hope not. Yet I know you will be alright. When good battles evil, which side do you believe wins? The side with the bigger levels? Do you have faith that good is triumphant? Well, I'd say yes, but uh, my track record's not been that good when I've been beat by Barf twice in a row. <laughs> One thing you must never lose is courage. If you believe in the goal, you are striving for, you will be courageous. There are many difficult times ahead, but you must keep your sense of humor. Well then, I think we're pretty good on that one. Work through the tough situations and enjoy yourself. Fine, enjoy myself. Because uh, getting roofied is not one of them. When you have finished this cup of coffee, your adventure will begin again. Well, what else would it do, end? That'd be a pretty weird ending to a game. Drink for my coffee! Say yes, it ends! Next, you must pass through a vast desert and proceed to the big city of... You know what? I'm just going to call the big city, uh, four. Adama. Saul. Akita. Fourth party member we've not run into yet. I wish you luck. Definitely this coffee was laced with something. Now I gotta sell some stuff. If I drink a coffee again, I don't have to go through that, do I? Drink coffee before I go? Uh, okay, we're gonna say yes, and I swear if I... Really? You couldn't just... I can't skip, huh? No. I was waiting for it to say, really? You wanted to drink from this again? Boy, somebody really wants a long night. Alright, so I guess we have a, about a minute and a half. We'll go ahead and let this run its course. <sighs> well, I guess we're going to try it a third time. I'll say no this time. And it's going to start it up again because he's going to be like, you don't got a choice in the matter. Choice is irrelevant. Which will probably waste the last little bit of time. Maybe. You can't see it, but I am pressing the A button vigorously right now. You'd think they'd be a skip in case somebody thought like me to do this. Nope. So, if any of us end up pregnant, uh, I'm sending you the bill. 
Yes? No? Yeah, no, I know. The whole name spanning out like stairs. Yeah, you're telling me the journey will be long. I have to put up with this twice, maybe three times. And what was the point of drinking the coffee? An interlude? Wouldn't that just work better if I walked through the cave? And it's like... Da -da 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 -da! I think our characters might have actually fallen asleep. Dude, I finished this cup a while ago. You're just repeating yourself. Which definitely adds up to my coffee being laced. This desert cannot be as big as this. <laughs> Alright. Yay, we're nearing the end, and I can say no and watch them make me go through it anyway. And then I'm running away from this little creature and never coming back. Aye, aye, mon capitan! Well, now I know what the kids from that 70s show feels like, at least. All right, let's say no. Please, please don't force me to drink coffee. No. Why you say no? Okay, I was waiting for him to say do it anyway. All right. All home, Zoom. Appreciate. I so happy, 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 Zoom. I'll be happy as long as I don't have to listen to that crap again. All right. I believe this is shop. Yes? No, I can't remember in all honesty. Yes! Okay, good, 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 good. Alright, pretty sure this is gonna end the episode now. Uh... So... Need the ATM card, because I need money. I'm betting I can't get rid of the jar of fly, honey. I should probably send it to my sister. Alright, so let's go ahead and, I guess, sell that for a couple bucks. Oh, really? 56? That is not what that looked like, but... Yes, I want to buy. Yeah, no. Alright, yes, I want to sell... My other sandwich. That still looks like $18. Okay, it is. I don't know why I thought it was 56. Alright, anything else left to sell? No, the Rust Pomoto could be good. I'm gonna get rid of the pack of bubblegum too. I don't I don't feel like the monkey's gonna come back anytime soon. $210, dang. Slime generator. Well, I guess we know what I'm thinking. Alright. Oh, thank you. Alright. Oh, wait. I got a call. Craps. Back in. Or around the building. Loop around the building. Alright. Uh, well, I guess let's call Mom first to be not homesick. Hello. Hello. Is that you, Adama? I can hardly hear it. What, am I not, not homesick anymore? That's great. Okay, yeah, you've said that before, but... Okay, Escargo Express. This is Escargo Express. Oh, is that you, Adama? Big bro, it's me, Tracy. I'm working part-time for Escargo Express. What can I do for you? I need you to pick up. You want us to store something for you? We'll send someone over immediately to pick it up. Now, nah, I gotta wait outside. Probably not at the stairs. But I'm sure this is really confusing to get around. Hello, 
Hello, this is S Cargo Express. Your delivery charge is eighteen dollars. You can cover the bill, right? I don't know. Seven hundred eighty-nine dollars seems less than eighteen, but we'll see if it works. All right, can take up to three things. Take the jar of honey. Watch me need it afterwards. What do you want me to take? Uh, I believe just the pack of bubble gum. Will there be anything else? I do not believe so. Let me just confirm your request. You want me to take the jar of fly honey, the pack of bubble gum. Is this correct? Yes. All right, certainly. Thanks a lot. You know, I don't know why the entity ever took Dwight. Seems like he's pretty good at his job. Comes in a few seconds, leaves just as fast. Alright. So now, even though I don't trust the hot springs, we'll go in and heal. No, I think I went into the wrong... Maybe? No, do you want slumber? Yes. And Akita fixed the broken air gun. The Magnum air gun? Yo, buddy, you really, you really need to, uh, stop creating deadly guns that are weaker. Beautiful. Okay, well, I was going to save here, but we'll go back up and save there, because I want to sell this gun and get stuck in a tree. All right. Oop, we go. Hi, hi, hi! You come buying, you can sell too! Yes. I want to sell. Why would I... T why would I tell you I want to sell things if I didn't want to sell things? Alright, dear, 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 boing. No can buy that. Why can't you buy my Magnum? Okay, that sounded wrong. But well, screw it. He can keep it for a bit. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna call Dwight back here. All right, let's call Dad and save. Adam, it's your dad. I deposited two thousand hundred thirty-eight dollars into your bank account. Taking what you've spent, you should now have too much money that I'm probably not gonna need in the bank. Well, experience is Adam 718, Saul 4861, Akita. Akita's got 23,000, let's just. Yeah. Alright, we'll record. Yes. Good night, sleep tight. I don't want to because you do the same thing regardless. Alright, we will apparently pick up the phone again. We will go ahead and leave it there for today. When we come back. Maybe I'll call Dwight back, I don't know. But we'll go back up through the door and continue our journey through a desert and to the town of four. Until then, remember, keep gaming. Never give up. And whatever you do, when a naked man offers you coffee, say no. Just say no.